Yeah, I mean, I think in a way it's like everything comes comes full circle, right? I mean, back in the day, you know, you if you think about in the you know the early days of television, what what TV commercials were not direct response, right? There was never you weren't actually in many cases. I mean, in the early days, they were really clunky, but then TV, TV commercials became kind of a form of entertainment, right? I mean, you think about the Super Bowl ads. They're not trying to sell you anything at all, right? And, 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 but you're, you're, they're building brand affinity, right? And they're, and they're making you so that, so that you go, okay, well, when I, want it, when I decide I want product X, I'm going to choose this brand because I, mm-hmm. I can relate to it. They get me. I get them. You know, they're willing to make fun of themselves, whatever. They were authentic, right? I think that yeah. this, this, so in this regard, yeah, I think that the Gen Z is, you know, they're a very serious generation. They're growing up in a, in, in a really crappy time, right? I mean, can you imagine, can you imagine graduating from university like, it this year right oh my goodness uh, like it, it, it'd be a nightmare right and and, yeah. and and things weren't good before right i mean like <laughs> you, you know like in the u.s you weren't you know your chances of, in the or the uk your chance of buying a house you know is like is not not the same yeah. so, so 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 they're very practical they're very like you know they, they kind of go everything is just kind of bs and so it has to be very authentic right and 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 the one thing i think that cuts through is 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 humor, right? I mean, they're just massive consumers of memes and massive creators of memes, you know. And yeah. I think, and I think that's the other the other part of it is, you know, you need you need brands that allow them to be, to essentially take some ownership by by re repurposing and recreating, you know, like like letting people create memes out of your your brand and things like that, making it kind of yeah. interactive and and having a life of its own. Um, so I, I yeah. hadn't seen this guy and I'm not, I'm no expert in TikTok by any stretch, uh, yeah. you know, I, and I've kind of looked at the products that I've been marketing are for generally older, older generations. So yeah. it's, it's, you know, but, but I am, I'm right on top of it with, with Twitch. And I think Twitch is, yeah. a, is a great example where, you know, it's just very authentic content, right? And, it, and, mm-hmm. and if somebody, you know, and and it's and it it really relies on the person to sell something. If they're going to sell something, they either have to be playing the game and just being like having a great time, obviously, and then the game sells, right? Or they have to be kind of very self-aware about it and like, mm-hmm. hey, look, I'm going to pitch this because whatever X, Y, and Z reason, and you know, and you're going to respond to that. But if they if they try and yeah, you can't be sneaky. You can't you can't pretend like you're not going to you know like you're going to pull the wool over somebody's eyes, right? 